Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if you're coming across an error message on Windows 10 or Windows 11, where it says that some settings are managed by your organization in Windows Update. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So first thing I recommend doing, if you're using a work or school account, you may want to consider disconnecting it and then reconnecting the device. If you open up the search menu and type in settings, best match should say settings. Go ahead and open that up. Select accounts on the left panel here. And on the right side, you want to select the access work or school tile. If you're currently connected to a work or school account, I would suggest disconnecting from that account and then attempt to reconnect and see if that resolves the problem. But also we want to check or change your network ID settings and make sure that they are correct. So open up the search menu. Type in advanced system settings. Best match should come back with a view advanced system settings. Go ahead and open that up. And now underneath the computer name tab, go ahead and left click on that. Select the network ID button. And then you would go ahead and select this is a home computer. It's not part of business network, unless it was part of a business network, in which case you would select that option. And then you would select next. And you will need to restart your computer. So go ahead and select finish and select OK, and then restart your computer for the changes to take effect. And then hopefully once you've restarted, the problems should be resolved that that could have potentially been the cause of it. One final thing you can also check if you're running Windows 10 or Windows 11 Professional or Higher Edition, open up the search menu and type in Group Policy. Best match should come back with Edit Group Policy. Go ahead and open that up. And now, let me just make this window a little bit wider here. Underneath Computer Configuration, you want to double click on the Administrative Templates folder. Do the same thing for the Windows Components folder, and then locate Windows Update and just left click on that. Double click on the Manage End User Experience folder and then double click on the Configure Automatic Updates over here. Just double click on it. And you want to set this to Not Configured. If it's set to either Enabled or Disabled, go ahead and select Not Configured and then select Apply and OK. And then once you are done with that, go ahead and close out of here. If you had to make any changes, you would need to restart your computer. And then hopefully, once again, this should have resolved the problem. And as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.